Dreams of Monaco goes in. And they're off. Dreams of Monaco and Gendini. Also, there is Lotta Sense moving forward. Unopposed, this long shot. And Divaco to the inside. Dreams of Monaco, a bit reluctant to load, is gradually edging over to set that pace. In front from Unopposed, just in second and Lotta Sense. And Vivaco is sent up on the inside, saving ground there. So help me, Hannah's only two and a half from the front. And Gendini, deep on the outside of the white cap. Gendini has moved up into third as they head for the far turn run. As O'Reilly is now outgunned. And Toby Hoos on the inside. Second last position, and one more well back is Saratoga Valley, who's loping along well back of the field. Got to be some 17 lengths off that pace of 23 and four fifths of a second as Vivaco has worked through on the inside to grab the lead. Vivaco, Gendini moves second on the outside, so help me, Hanna is next as there's less than three aces to go. Dreams of Monaco, that early leader, has backed off. Then to the outside, we have a really, and then a lot of sense in between horses. Toby Who saves ground at the top of the stretch. The half went in 48 and two-fifths of a second, and they make the turn for home. Vivaco. Vivaco is just in front. Vivaco O'Reilly toward the center of the track. Then Gindini is third, just at an even pace, center of the track. Saratoga Valley, who was so far back, is gobbling up the ground now, and here comes Saratoga Valley and Taylor Hole. Saratoga Valley and O'Reilly. Saratoga Valley, long shot O'Reilly. Saratoga Valley beats 45 to 1. Oh, really? And Vivaco was next. Close for the next spot, Toby. Who or Gendini? Photo race five. Photo finish. Number one, Saratoga Valley was first, second, number seven, O'Reilly, and third, number two, Vivaco, and fourth, number nine, Gindini. Race five is official.